الرحمن الرحيم والصلاة والسلام على رسول الله محمد السيد الأولي الأخير مدد يا رسول الله مدد سادة أصحاب رسول الله مدد مشاهنا دستور ما شاء الله فاز دعسا إن شاء الله مدد الله محقان مدد طريقتنا الصحبة والخير في الجمعية Our Holy Prophet states whoever keeps his religion in end times is as if he's holding onto a piece of burning coal. So it is hard to keep the religion. If you hold on to it, your hands burn. But if you let go, you lose religion. Therefore, these times are difficult times. However much we can do, we should not leave it. We should perform every sunnah, every wajib and fard that we can do. And do as much as we can do. If we say it is hard, we can't do it and leave them, that would be wrong. People do even harder things. But when it comes to worship, they say they cannot do it. They do much more difficult things than worship and for useless purposes, not for earning a living, but for entertaining their ego for going out and what not. The things they do are much more difficult than worship. They are things that they do that are very difficult. However, when it comes to worship, they leave it. They say it is hard or they do not have time for it. They have time for everything else except for worship. When it comes to worship, they don't have time. This is something that any normal person should keep. It's the most important thing in life. Allah has created us for worship, not for other things. Not in order to become a manager or a director. Allah will not ask us why you didn't become a director, a chief. Allah will ask us why you didn't perform any worship. States Allah And I did not create the jinn and mankind except to worship me. He says, the only duty of people and jinn is to worship. When you are with Allah, to earn a living is also worship. To get married in a halal way is worship. To look after the children is worship. And to raise them well is worship. They're all, as long as they are for the pleasure of Allah, it is all worship. However, when you leave your short worship because you say it's difficult, nothing you do is counted as worship. It is all counted as done for your ego. Therefore, it's hard, but the harder it is, the more valuable it is, and the more significant it becomes. The worship people do and perform in these times is more valuable compared to older times. The harder it is, the more it will be rewarded. This is a great opportunity given to us by Allah Azza wa Jalla. With difficulty, there's more profit. May Allah make our worship continuous. Ahl Tariqa, people of Tariqa, should be more careful of this. Sometimes they don't know Sharia much, or even if they know, they don't show 
much importance to it, but we should pay attention to this as much as we can, as much as possible. May Allah not separate us from the right path. May He give us all love for this way and love for worship, inshallah.